I think some of the most Machiavellian characters in Game of Thrones are those who aren't born to the great families. A character like Peter Baelish, Littlefinger, uh, who is the treasurer uh, or, or master of coin, as we call it, of the realm when the books open. Um, he's, although he's born to a noble house, it's a very weak noble house. His lands are a few acres and a, and a kind of rundown tower house, and he has a lot of sheep and sheep pellets. That's his inheritance. Um, but he has his mind, and he has subtlety, and he, he climbs, and he maneuvers, and he, he has great skill with uh, finances, which is something that a lot of the higher-born nobles consider beneath them, worrying about money and stuff like that. So he's able to accumulate more and more money and more and more power and befriending everyone. He's everybody's friend. He's always very helpful. Uh, and people find him very useful to their schemes. And as a result, he gets everybody's ear. He gets involved in all these plots. He's probably the most Machiavellian character in Game of Thrones. But book Littlefinger and television show Littlefinger are very different characters. They're probably the character that's, that's most... Um, different from the from the book to the television show. Um.